Yo, what it do, everybody? I know I haven't finished my Dragon Age Origins uh, playthrough. Uh, reason for that being that I've been waiting for a headset for a while. Well, not a headset, but a part for my headset. Uh, this is a laptop that I'm playing on, and it's considerably better than the um, desktop I have. But the drawback is it only had one uh, port, like most laptops do. So I was waiting for a part so that I could use my headset for it. My... Um, my microphone and my headphones at the same time. Now my voice will be a lot clearer. Uh, the sound will be a lot more crisp. There won't be as many distortions and things of that sort. Um, I tried streaming this game to friends earlier today. I'm just kind of trying to slowly ease my way into streaming a little bit. So. Um, one thing I found out about this game, it is horrible when it comes to uh, programs running on the side. Like, really bad. So, I just figured I won't stream it, I'll record it. And so far, the only one that works Don't forget, decently with it is, must be forgotten. is Fraps. So, shadow hunting me. I must hurry. My name is Daniel. I live in London at, at uh, Mayfair. What have I done? This is crazy. Don't forget. Don't forget. I must stop him. Focus. My name is... Is... I am Daniel. Yeah, you know, I streamed it, or I tried streaming it, and it uh, did not work out at all, so... But, you know, um, I find that recording it will be a lot easier. Less lag. All of that stuff. Hopefully it doesn't crash on me. I don't know. This game has very weird, uh, very weird glitches that happen with uh, other programs, and you're trying to stream or record. But I was really getting into it, so I figured I'd record a little bit of it. I could do this side by side with my Dragon Age Origins thing, so. Or to put it bluntly, I record what I want. <laughs> you know, I don't give a shit what any of you motherfuckers want. Anyway, I love you though. So, but it's Halloween, dude. I have to play something scary. You know, I have to play something scary. I have to. I was, I was really getting into this, like. I've always wanted to play this game. And big thing to know also. Um, I suck at horror games. And not in the sense that I don't know what I'm doing. But I'm really freaking horrible at being a man and just finishing. <laughs> I just suck. In general, I get so scared. I get so freaking scared. So you're probably gonna hear me scream a few times, and it's the fact that the lights are all off right now, and the fact that um, it's this late at night is not gonna help. But you know. Hey, I'm facing my demons, you know. I am facing my demons. Oh. He 
Yep. That, uh, that didn't sound good. But, um... I'm gonna turn VSeq on, because I'm seeing some tearing. But yeah, I really suck at horror games so much. Oh. Yeah, earlier today I tested a few games on stream and they all worked except for this one. This game is absolute shit for optimization. And it's bad because it's been out for so long. I really don't like that, but whatever. I just thought, eh, just record the damn thing. Oh. Yeah, it just constantly kept crashing and crashing and crashing and crashing. It was not getting along with OBS Studio at all. Uh, tried recording it with uh, Windows 10 recorder, but it was iffy because Windows 10 recorder has such a big hook on it. Which I like Windows 10 recorder. I'm not saying it's bad, but it's got a really weird, um, I don't know, I want to say... Uh, A delay on it. People who, who use it will know what I mean. So, I, you know, I just figure. Go ahead, record it. And hope to whoever that it does not freaking like freeze. Yeah, I don't know if it was um, OBS that was doing it or the game because I, ne I never really had any problems with the game itself um, aside from like a start menu glitch but I fixed that but I don't know I had streamed other games perfectly fine and what I usually do I don't really when I'm streaming when I the very rare occasion that I do um, the very very rare occasion that I do stream I'm um, I tend to use DX Tori and unironically this is one of the games that DX Tori does not detect either so that is a giant bummer So yes, just to quit the conversation, this game sucks for recording. Big time, so I'm stuck using fraps for this, because it's the easiest method for me. Whatever.
voices. Oh, hello. Uh, I just, I, I, I suck at horror games. I, I'm already nervous. I just suck. You know, it's crazy because I love horror movies so much. Very dark in here. Let's see. 19th of August, 1839. I wish I could ask how much you remember. I don't know if there will be anything left after I consume this drink. Don't be afraid, Daniel. I can't tell you why, but know this. I choose to forget. Try to find comfort and strength in that fact. There is a purpose. You are my final effort to put things right. God willing, the name Alexander of Brandenburg still invokes bitter anger in you. If not, this will sound horrible. Go to the inner sanctum, find Alexander, and kill him. His body is old and weak, and yours, young and strong. He will be no match for you. One last thing. A shadow is following you. It's a living nightmare, breaking down reality. I have tried everything, and there is no way to fight back. You need to escape it as long as you can. Redeem us both, Daniel. Descend into the darkness where Alexander waits, and murder him. Your former self, Daniel. I'm a huge fan of uh, Eldritch stuff too, like cosmic powers and stuff, Alexandrian stuff I guess you could say. Not Alexandrian, how do you say, um, like Cthulhu stuff, cosmic energy and crap like that, that's, that's my niche right there, so. This game, it's like right up my alley. This, I love this Victorian era stuff. Reminds me of Dracula a lot, but um, I'm more, I'm more of like a fan of uh, Cthulhu stuff. One game I'm really close to beating is uh. Cthulhu Dark Corners of the Earth. That's like one of the only scary games or horror games that I've uh, like beat till the end aside from the Resident Evil games and Silent Hill maybe. I used to be a lot better with horror stuff. It's just I've always been into movies and I, I got into horror games late for some reason. And I never, I don't know, I guess I wasn't prepared for them, and I'm still not prepared. I just get really, I get so much anxiety when things heat up. Alexander, is it inside the castle? In a manner of speaking, come, bring the lamp. You've been to the refinery, have you not? I don't believe I have. Is it connected to the... What did you call it? The inner sanctum. My most precious chamber, Daniel. And it lies well beyond the refinery. In fact, it lies beneath the very stone of Brennenberg. Okay, so... Where should I go first? I'll start downstairs first. More chest. Uh, 
gonna take a while to get used to this whole swinging thing with the doors and stuff. So it looks like I have to just go here because I know that thing down there is uh, blocked off. Laboratory. How do you run? Con no, control is crouch. Okay, shift. Okay, a wine cellar. I just hope that I'm still recording, because if I'm not, I'm going to be pissed. Matter of fact, let me ch let me quit and check. Well, looks like we're good. Yippee, you guys get to see me shit my pants. Swore I just saw somebody in the corner. Oh boy. See, I just, I, I, I do not do good with this shit. Oh, dude, this is like. Jeez. You better believe I am saving every single tender box for when I need it. And my lantern. Oh boy. You see, whenever I was streaming this, I was focused more on it staying up. So, I didn't really notice many of these jump scares. But boy, oh boy. Also found out what was causing uh, I don't you see I'm so freaking critical of my videos because I always make want to make sure that they're good I also found out what was causing rumbling in my videos it was something that something uh, that came with this laptop called uh, cams no not cams uh, waves max audio something like that and I had it set to gaming because at first I thought it sounded good but it really doesn't it just made everything sound like a freaking mountain or something. It's just horrible. But with this new part for my uh, headset, I'll be able to uh, get better audio in general. So, that is awesome. 
I'm able to use spatial sound and all of that. Yeah, you see I read this already. It's all good. I'm not sure what this is because it, it opens it. I have no idea what that is. I don't know what that's for. I don't know what I do with it. I picked up a chemistry pot. I wonder what I... Head, head is pounding and hands are shaking. Palms are sweaty and mom's spaghetti. Oh shit, what happened? Oh. I guess that's where that was supposed to go? So that's where it went? Cool. I inadvertently solved the puzzle. Awesome. Okay. So yeah, all of these chemicals end up just like... I think I'm gonna need another one of these, no, 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 they're all there. So you know, all of these are gonna like combine. And then I, I take it and I guess I pour it on, there's like this goop downstairs or something. And I guess I gotta pour it on that. Chests or it looked like chests. Huh. Pick this up. Ah, fuck. No, I don't think these are chests, sir. It looks so much like chess though. If that's a normal container box, it's really weird. But whatever. I don't think there's anything else I need in here. thing, buddy. Oh. I honestly have so many games that I want to play that I haven't played before, and I just, I hope before my life gets mega, mega, mega busy that I'm able to play all of them because it would really upset me if I wouldn't be able to. No, oh. Sound like it was coming from upstairs. Okay, I can't get through there obviously.
Okay, can't get through there. Really glad that so far this is letting me do my thing. Oh boy. broken down door I if I am not mistaken I'm about to see some action uh, man oh god oh. 16th of May 1839 the unflinching African sun has continued to plague our expedition, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, the mother of us all. An interesting story in its own right, but I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand-covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. like a, a, a door and drawer open, opening simulator. Jesus. That's all I do. This game essentially reminds me of a first person alone in the dark, to be honest with you. I just love cosmic horror. I think it's some of the best horror. By cosmic horror, I don't mean like. I mean, I mean like ancient gods and stuff like that is what I really like. Sea creatures and things like that, gods that people forgot about that they left by, that they left behind, and things like that of that nature. I really like that kind of stuff. It intrigues the hell out of me.
What? What the f- Oh my god. Oh. Is that a piano playing? regretting this. This already I'm regretting it. Horrible idea. <gasps> what the f- Oh. Oh my god. Dude, I don't want to go in here. Oh, this- This was the door that I- Yeah, I decided to like backtrack. Okay. You can't start... Oh, you can. You see, I don't want to waste all of my tinder boxes, though. I might be a noob at horror games, but I know... I know the rules. Just like in Resident Evil, you never want to shoot your gun too much. A fight or flight kind of thing. I know that much. Search every nook and cranny, reserve ammo, reserves light sources, that kind of shit. I know, I know. That's why you see me putting my lantern away a lot. What the? Local history. Okay, so I need a key somewhere. Obviously. Is this a chest or, or these look like chests? I swear. Seventeenth of May, eighteen thirty nine. My hand trembles as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. Oof. Yeah, see, that's that's what I'm saying, like, the idea of other gods, um, 
forgotten gods coming back, that kind of stuff in horror. I love that. Um, gods from another planet or aliens, that kind of stuff. It just, it's just so fascinating to me. I just like that horror so much. It gives you a sense of, okay, look, there's literally nothing I can do about it. And I, I, to me, it increases the horror. I'm gonna search this place a little bit longer. I think I've, I must have missed something. I don't know. I just feel like I did. There's supposedly supposed to be a key. Apparently, no. all of my stuff. There's got, there might be something in this big ass room here is the thing. I didn't really look much. I don't think I came down here yet. Oh my god, dude, I'm so... Dude... Oh... I did Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh... Definitely refilling this. Definitely refilling this. Oh yeah. Fill that bitch right up. Like this. Ooh. This is where the piano was supposedly playing. Come on. Oh, God. What's this? Like a chart or something. I can't I like this. No. Okay. Much of the castle is old and hasn't been tended to for centuries. When the shadow arrives, it won't take long until things start falling apart. They're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble and there's a risk everything will cave in on us. Especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. 
Okay, so I'm guessing this guy had like this thing from those caverns that him and those people discovered and it followed him here and he was preparing for that or he knew that it would or something to that effect oh man it's I don't... Oh! 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 Oh boy! What happened? Oh no! <laughs> I'm stuck! Happy day, oh happy day. <sighs> okay, what's this? What's happening? What's happening? Seventeenth of May, eighteen thirty nine. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized. It was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. I reached out, closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away, unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted, the voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety, and grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. do I do? What did I just write? The piano keeps playing. I wonder. I wonder if there's something to do with the piano. No.
God, man, what is that snake shit that keeps happening? Like, what is that? Maybe I have to pull on a book or something. I know on Alone in the Dark you have to pull on a lot of books. This game is basically, like I said, Alone in the Dark first person. A lot of the same things, but the big difference is you can't kick ugly rats on your bummer. Oh, what do you do on here? Oh, man, I, oh, I think I'm trapped. I don't... Maybe... What? Maybe... Oh shit. I'm gonna have to stop using my lamp. Give it a rest for a minute. Wait, 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 there's like a... You have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, that. So these books stick out and something happens whenever you press on, uh, whenever you pull on them, so, and I think that's what that whole, okay, so this is another one. I'm so scared to turn around.
What? Oh, that door was not open a while ago. Oh, God. Oh. Okay, just get out of here as fast as you can. Oh, my God. Um... <laughs> Oh no. Oh no 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 no. <laughs> oh god. this oh, I can't do it oh <gasps> holy shit what is it oh, what is this oh no dude I gotta <sighs> oh my Oh no. <laughs> oh. Okay, I think I've shitty su shit myself enough for tonight, guys. I'm gonna, I'm gonna call it quits for tonight. 